Keeping the community safe is not only a council priority, but one of the key purposes of a municipality. One of the ways that we do this is through our protective services department, which includes fire services, policing and enforcement, as well as animal control and disaster services. Hi, I'm here with uh, Pat Mahoney. He's our fire chief and manager of protective services. Pat, I'd like you to tell us a little bit about 2021 and what your priorities are, knowing that Council has committed $5.3 million to improve our ability to keep our community safe through fire services, emergency response services, as well if you can touch on some of the work that you do with the Sturgeon Regional Emergency Management Partnership. Sure, Madam Mayor. So in the 2021 budget, um, we were funded for three full-time firefighters in addition. So that brings up our full-time staff to 12. So what's this done? It's enabled us to have full-time staff both in Bonacord and the Mail, and running shifts from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m., seven days a week, 365 days a year, which has improved our service levels and also our response times. Valuable support and funding also apply to the enforcement services and what they bring to Sturgeon County and their residents. Our requests for services, uh, both on the enforcement and fire, continue to rise and having uh, solid funding to help us do that work is very important. It's also allowed us to maintain a very extensive capital program, which allows us to have up-to-date apparatus with industry standards and able to serve our community. Also, a new initiatives such as the use of drones are taking place with, uh, within our department. So Chief Mahoney, obviously knowing that we've come out of a critical incident or an ongoing critical incident that's taken place over the past year, can you speak a little bit to the Sturgeon Regional Emergency Management Plan and how the foundation of that work assisted you in responding to the community's needs uh, throughout the COVID pandemic? Sure, Madam Mayor. So when uh, COVID-19 you know, started back in March, um, we were meeting on a regular basis with that partnership, but when COVID-19 started, we began meeting bi-weekly so we had representatives from all the municipalities within the county and the towns speaking regularly on a weekly basis. In, you know, so we were working together, the same messaging was, was coming out. Um, certainly in emergency services, uh, we always did have a certain amount of risk and, and continue. So we had all that plus COVID. So ensuring our staff had the proper uh, protective equipment in place, proper processes, uh, you know, really looking after our own people internally so we can help the people externally. Um, so having the SREP partnership and knowing what all of our neighboring municipalities were and planning together, getting the same messages out, I think has really been beneficial for the whole area. Well, as we know, our protective services is uh, an integral part of building a safe and caring community. And we are just so grateful, Chief Mahoney, for you and your team for taking care of people uh, often at a really critical time and you're doing a great job and we thank you very much for that.